The Type 99 Alpha Tank is China's advanced product. This tank was designed and produced by Norinco Industries. Its purpose was replacing outdated tanks in Chinese ground forces. Development work began during the 1990s in China. Early models were known by the name Type 98. These models were foundations for designing the final version. In 2001, the Type 99 appeared. Later, the improved Type 99 Alpha was created. The Type 99 Alpha entered service in 2011. This tank was first displayed during a major Beijing parade. Today, it forms the backbone of China's heavy armored units. Total built numbers are nearly 700 of this model. Main weapon is a 125 mm smoothbore gun. It fires both conventional shells and guided anti-tank missiles. The guided missiles can reach targets 5 kilometers away. The gun has an autoloader to increase firing rate. Practical fire rate is nearly 10 rounds every minute. Ammunition is stored inside carousel loader and hull compartments. Besides the gun, a coaxial machine gun is mounted. A heavy 12.7 millimeter gun is turret mounted. For close defense, smoke grenade launchers are turret mounted. These systems produce smoke screens and block enemy's line. Tank armor is composite, made from strong steel and ceramics. Explosive reactive armor blocks are fitted onto hull. Reactive armor is effective against missiles and shape charges. Layered protection significantly improves survivability of the tank. Overall protection equals nearly 1,000 millimeters rolled steel. This level of armor is effective against modern threats. A laser warning receiver is installed around the turret. It detects hostile laser beams and triggers defensive actions. The turret carries JD-3 defensive blinding laser system. This laser can disable enemy optics and targeting sensors. An infrared jammer is installed near the main gun. This device confuses guidance of some anti-tank missiles. The tank has an advanced internal fire suppression system. It also includes NBC filters against chemical or biological. The diesel engine generates 1,500 horsepower maximum power. This turbocharged engine provides extremely strong mobility performance. Maximum speed on roads is 80 kilometers per hour. Operational range with internal fuel is about 600. With extra fuel tanks, range extends up to 800. Transmission is semi-automatic with six forward gears total. Driver controls the tank using steering wheel and pedals. Suspension uses torsion bars with hydraulic shock absorbers. This suspension allows stable movement across rough terrain easily. Tank climbs 60% gradients without significant performance loss. It crosses vertical obstacles 1 meter and trenches 3 meters. For deep rivers, a snorkel kit can be mounted. Digital fire control increases accuracy of the main gun. System includes ballistic computer and precise laser rangefinder system. Thermal sights are provided for commander and gunner. Hunter killer capability enables engaging multiple targets simultaneously. A millimeter wave radar is mounted on the turret. This radar identifies targets and distinguishes friend from foe. A digital battlefield management system is built inside. It connects directly with Chinese command and control network. Communications include secure radios and encrypted data links. Navigation uses Badu satellites and internal inertial guidance system. Commander can view digital maps and real-time unit positions. This improves overall situational awareness of the crew. Earlier models included experimental Type 98 prototypes only. These prototypes paved the way for Type 99. The original Type 99 appeared in 2000. The Alpha version was its upgraded enhanced successor. 
changes included larger turret, new armor, stronger engine. Main gun gained ability to fire guided missiles. Electronics improved greatly with digital communication systems included. Hatches and turret design were fully redesigned. Unique feature is its defensive blinding laser system. This technology is absent on most other modern tanks. Strong engine power provides speed and mobility advantages. Gun and missile flexibility remain major battlefield strengths. Main weakness is ammunition layout beneath the turret. This design can be dangerous if armor penetration occurs. Absence of hard kill active defense is another limitation. High production cost restricted widespread mass deployment. Despite limitations, the Type 99 Alpha is successful. It represents China's technological progress in armor development programs. Its features combine firepower, protection, and battlefield mobility. Today, it stands among the most modern tanks. Thank you.